Southern Columbia ends another chapter of this storied program's history, securing its 14th state championship in school history. Now with the win, the Tigers become just the 24th high school football team across the country ever to win seven consecutive state titles. Let's check out the highlights from this afternoon out to Cumberland Valley High School. You've got Southern Westinghouse 13-0 on the season. Southern gets the ball first, and on the second play of the game, guess who it is? Loudon Murphy reintroducing himself to this Bulldogs defense. You guys missed me? He's going to take it 83 yards to the end zone for the first score of the day. It's Southern 7-0. Westinghouse gets their chance on offense. Khalil Green tries a short dump off pass, but it's picked off by Isaac Carter. He avoids Green on the tackle and is seeing all green on his way for a 71-yard touchdown. Southern looking like the team that's dominated state title games over the last seven years, but hold on a sec. Third quarter, tied ball game. Green airing one for Keyshawn Hawkins. Makes the grab and takes it 51 yards for a touchdown. 20 unanswered from the Bulldogs. They take a 2014 lead. Six minutes to go in the fourth quarter. Southern at its own one-yard line. Garrett Garcia picks up the first down and a whole lot more. Breaks a couple tackles, eventually brought down at the 29. Then on fourth down, it's Blake Wise throwing one on a tight rope for Kyle Christman to pick up the first down. And the Tigers are in Westinghouse territory. Now in the red zone, they decide to run that inside reverse that works almost every time. Carter Madden, he needs 12 yards decked into the red paint for a touchdown with 42 seconds remaining. They go 99 yards, take the lead. It would end up being the game-winning drive and interception. Seals the deal. Southern Columbia, once again, is your AA state champions. Here's Brett Alper with more. Like many of the state championships that we've seen over the years, this one is one to remember. A 99-yard comeback drive for Southern Columbia to claim their seventh straight title and 14th championship overall. It was a test of character, and guess what? We passed. Great job. It is just awesome. This is like a movie. <laughs> I know it's kind of cliche, but it's like a movie ending. We were down at halftime. They had the momentum going in there and big plays. But our defense stepped it up, and our offense line the, the fourth quarter really showed what Southern Columbia football is about. I mean, it feels amazing. We won state championships before, but this just feels amazing because it's our senior year, and all of us have been playing together for so long. And uh, I knew as soon as I got the ball around that edge, my teammates had the, the end sealed off. I knew nothing was stopping me getting in that end zone. We've been in a number of these, and people ask from time to time about this one or that one or how this one or that one was different it's not going to be hard to remember this one it's not going to be hard to pinpoint why this one was different the Tigers biggest drive of the season came when they needed it the most and when their backs were against the wall at the one yard line with just over six minutes left they never doubted themselves as high school kids I'm sure there's there's not many of them that were sitting there in a huddle thinking oh my goodness we have to go 99 yards they're just thinking we got the ball we got enough time to score and we just got to make it happen we were pretty confident. It's, that's what football is about, that moment right there. There's nothing, there's no better feeling that you could do what we just did, and it's just awesome. Seniors like Isaac Carter and Garrett Garcia finished their high school career, winning the state championship all four years, and another one for Jim Roth on his resume. Reporting in Mechanicsburg, Brett Alper, 2822 Sports.